Mascots are the staple of school spirit. There's the familiar ones like the Tigers, the Wildcats, the Bulldogs. What about the unfamiliar ones? Ole Miss is one school with a fresh new face, and WCBI Sports' Courtney Robb reports from Oxford with more. Visit any sporting event at the University of Mississippi and you find the usual. Some wild fans, energetic cheerleaders, and of course, a rich history. But Ole Miss does have one thing, unlike any of the aforementioned, and his name is Tony. No one else has a, a land shark. Um, you know, he's he's unique to Ole Miss. Developed by the student body, the unorthodox mascot was modeled after the memory and mentality of former Ole Miss linebacker Tony Fine, the first person in history to ever throw the infamous fins up. That's giving the signal there of sharks. Blood in the water, the sharks are going after it. It really came about from the embracing of a, 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 a sort of a swagger type way of going about things, a, a mark of, of of confidence, a mark of accomplishment, um, uh, even a, a mark of hello, you know, a greeting. It's, you know, it's, it's, it can be used in many ways. But there is no one Tony, but rather it's a team of six foot individuals playing the land shark character. Everybody that does fit that build, um, you come to tryouts and you get to try on the suit. Um, we give you, uh, like, we give you some band music and say, like, okay, so the band's playing the fight song, like, how are you going to react? Um, we practice not talking in the suit. We practice all having the same walk. Um, we would hate to have, you know, one Tony skips and one Tony is like really slow. We want him to just be a, you know, one character. I wanted to learn myself of what it took to be Tony. And I figured what better way to learn than to learn from the master himself. Here with the Tony, the land shark Tony. What is it like being you? What's your favorite go-to pose? Can you give me your favorite go-to pose? Oh, okay, okay, interesting. And then Tony, can you give me a big? Can, you, can we do the fins up together? How do? You, can you t teach me how to do it? Like that? Perfect. I tell people all the time, <clears throat> you're not going to find a more poignant or meaningful mascot story in all of college athletics. So. How important is it to remember Tony Fine through the land shark? It's, it, it can't be stated how important it is. It's, it's, it's awesome to see. I think people really love him because he is unique and he does have a great story. And, you know, he's named after somebody who was really important to our university. And I think knowing all of that and knowing his history um, just makes people love him even more. Anyone that is interested in becoming a Tony should look for information come February. Reporting in 